guys, Jason here, out in front of the shop again, getting ready to do an unboxing video of a new product we're getting ready to review. But before we do that, let's take a look at some of the exciting things we have coming soon. Alright guys, hope that was exciting for you. Hope you really enjoyed uh, seeing what we've got coming. You know, this year with COVID and everything going on, I've had some time to kind of reevaluate things. One thing I'm guilty of is hoarding projects and I'm done with it. Uh, getting stuff done and moving forward. So, I got a couple questions for you. Number one, what projects are you working on right now? Especially with us coming into winter time and us uh, with all the stay at home orders. What are you guys working on? What are you doing? Uh, post some comments down below. Let us know and, uh, you know, We'd love to see what you guys are working on in the shop this year. Number two, um, we're getting ready to do some stuff, uh, how-tos and different things with different radio systems and whatnot. And without starting a brand war, no Chevy versus Ford, what radio system do you use? What do you like and why do you like it? All right, and third, guys, do us a favor. Go down below this video here. Give us a thumbs up uh, for the like and go ahead and subscribe to our channel. If you're new here and you haven't seen any of our videos before, go take a look at some of our content. We hope you like it, and if you do, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the bell to get notifications when we release new videos. We'd love for you, for you guys to be around and see what we have going on. All right, so what we have here is the Flex Innovations QQ Extra 300 G2 Night Flying Edition. Uh, we have a local club here that's getting ready to have a night fly. I've been wanting to go out and hang out with those guys and do that, so I figured what better excuse to get a new plane than, and from a new company than to go out and fly with my buddies. So I picked up the green edition, like what's down here, uh, with the night, night lights, and also they had a great uh, Black Friday deal going on where if you order the plane, you got a, a battery, a Potenza battery with it. So this is the ultra plug and play with the Aura flight control system, uh, has all the servos pre-installed. From what I understand, I hook up two of my uh, Spectrum satellite receivers to the Aura system, bind it up, and it's ready to fly. All programmed, everything. So I'm really excited about this. So let's get into the unboxing and see what we find. One of the exciting things about this is, uh, having been around RC for a long time now, coming up on 40 years, uh, Kike Samanzini's always been kind of a, a hero of the hobby. I remember watching him as an innovator in the in the days of the TOC and going out to Las Vegas to watch that event. So it's exciting to fly a plane that you know his company's put out and uh, to see what they're doing over there. All right, so here we go. Everything's wrapped neatly in plastic. Got a lot of good foam protection. We got our battery here that they threw in. See it's the green version. Got the servos pre-installed. All the links are already in. Carbon fiber wing and stab tube, which is cool. Kind of an interesting way to put the prop in here, just stab through the foam. But we got our prop, looks like it was probably not like that originally, but I could be wrong. So that's what we got here. I'm gonna go ahead and get a... All right. All right, so let's get out our trusty pocket knife here and let's take a look at what we got in here. Again, everything's wrapped in foam. Everything looks really well protected. Got our stabs here coming out first. Take a look at what we got. Okay, nice little joiner. That's, should be pretty nice that we got here on the other side. All right, so yeah, that joins the elevator house, which is good. You see the control horns pre-installed. Looks like assembly should be pretty quick at the spot for the carbon spar there. Set these down below. Let's see what else we got. Go ahead and cut all the tape while I'm here. Throw this aside. I don't know that we're using that anymore. Got all our foam. Okay. Got our bag here. Got our extension wire pre-run out here. Got our 
power lead for our lights inside the wing, which is cool. You do have uh, LED strips here that go on to the side force generators once it's built. I did take a glance at the uh, uh, build manual before receiving this. I do like, it's not live hinged. It's actually got, looks like Robart style hinges in the surface, which is cool. You got quite a bit of throw. We might, we might be able to get a little more than that. We'll see. Anyways, got a little tape there holding that in. So that's one wing. Got a, a good feel to it. It's a little, a little heavier than I expected on the wing, but we'll see what the all up weight looks like and how it flies, because that's the most important. Quality looking carbon fiber wing tube here. Tape residue is never fun, but we'll get that taken care of. All right, we've got a, looks like a black and white manual here with all our directions. Should be, should be good, we'll check that out. Let you guys know if you find any shortcomings. Again, more foam, another wing. All right guys, so we did get a couple comments on our last unboxing, which was of the Freedom Fox. Not the nicest. We got some nice comments, but we got a couple comments about unboxing being useless and just to go fly the plane. So let us know what you think. Hit the comments below, guys. Let us know if you think these unboxing videos are worthwhile. Uh, personally, I like to know what to expect. If a company's not boxing their planes well and, I, and there's a good chance it's going to show up damaged, I might be a little less likely to order it if I'm deciding between it and another company. So that's why we're doing this. But of course, but of course, we're always trying to provide the content you guys want to see. So let us know in the comments below. More foam. Let's go ahead and cut our tape. Here. Got a wire landing gear here. Uh, again, our battery. Let me get that out of the way. Set that down below here. So we got wire landing gear. Oh, nice touch. Gear comes all pre-made. Nice bent wire landing gear. It's got the fairings on it. It's got uh, wheel pants pre-installed. Everything looks to be ready to go. It looks like this gear just pops in the bottom of the fuse. Again, we'll go through that and see how that goes. But that's a that's a nice touch right there. Not have to deal with all the little uh, wheel collars or anything like that. So that's, that's good. Nice little unit there. Good looking ABS wheel pants. Nice little, yeah, they're solid. I like it. Good job. Good job, Flex. And got a nice little uh, hardware package here. It's got our spinner, Ooh, aluminum spinner, which is nice. Center bolt, which is good. Got what looks like some uh, decals, possibly some double sided tape, tail wheel, and a wiring diagram for the Aura system, which is, will be good to have, I'm sure. And last but not least, let me make sure. Oh, I got our side force generators also in here. Lastly, we've got our fuse slot. Let's check it out. I really like the colors. It really, this should really pop in the air. Again, really solid feeling plane. I've seen some videos of it and flying great. Of course, you know, you got Seth Arnold flying it, and that guy can fly a brick to put wings on it. So we'll see how that goes. Nice little quick release. ESC is already in, our wiring controller, motor, everything looks good. Nice plywood substructure that should keep it pretty strong and stiff, which should make for a good, good flying, good responding airplane. Well, overall, everything looks good, guys. Got a little access hatch down here. Got our Aura system. Got the two uh, servos for the tails in there, DS, or a tail in there, DS-15s. And we got some tape here, it looks like. I gotta figure that out. Probably just hold the magnets. Anyway, there you go, guys. That's the unboxing of the QQ Extra 300 G2 from Flex Innovations. Gonna get this together this week and get out and fly it, and then we'll report back and let you guys know what we think. Again, like, subscribe, share the channel. Any little bit helps, guys. Have a good one.